Alright guys, UD Paradox. No, I said I was going to do another deck profile, but since we're getting so close to the new ban list that might happen in April from what the website on Konami is saying, I want to go over some cards, some my predictions on what might get hit. It's a little bit scary for me. I mentioned in the last video that uh, with my ABC deck profile, go check it out if you haven't. Um, we Dracos might get hit. Simo just posted a picture on his YouTube showing the representation in YCS Costa Rica, I want to say. And you would think Pendulum Magicians would have the top representation because it's the number one deck. You know, people, it's the cheapest deck, to be honest, aside from Electromite, you know, being an $80 card, actually now dropping, considering it's getting so close to the ban list, it's kind of dropping a bit. But, you know, it's, uh, it's quite up there. So, the number one re re representation was True Draco Demise, or just True Draco in general, a form of True Draco with Masterpiece at three or two. It was scary. So, I know we've all seen the OCG ban list that just came out, I want to say last week, if not half a week ago, I don't remember offhand fully. But they hit, they also hit Ash Blossom to two. No idea why, hand traps aren't really the problem. I mean, sure they can be, but dice like True Dracos, we don't really run hand traps in the main deck anymore. No one really runs hand traps in the main deck, it's all in the side deck now. So, um, I guess in the OCG, it's a different meta. Yes, it is a different meta than ours. They may not hit Ash on our side. But, no, I don't want to donate, guys. I'm sorry. But what might happen is cards like Masterpiece might get hit to one, if not banned. Diagram might get hit, if not to one, you know, banned to one-ish. Cards like Stormforth might start coming back. Maybe they'll ban it. We don't know. We've seen how good it can be in some Draco decks. But the Sleeper, we're, we're all kind of expecting, that we've all been expecting for the past recent four or five ban lists, Terraforming. Terraforming, this is now a field spell meta game. Most decks, like Shoe Dracos, cannot run without their field spell. You have If you get rid of all three diagrams and we have no way to get it back into our decks... We basically lost half of our combo utility right there, if not all of it. You know, we might have gotten some use out of it, so our feet, our boards might be kind of scary. But if you noticed, if you ever did a Ghost Ogre, uh, you know, you ever popped it during the mirror match, used Apocalypse, half your per uh, your opponent's attack, popped your Disciples to do it, popped their diagram, and their diagram no longer works. That is a problem for the Draco players like me. Considering Diagram's now 55 50 to $55 now, it's starting to go back up to its original price, price when it first came out, $70. Whenever Draco's first got hit on the ban list, it dropped to 20 to $25. Now that Draco's are back in, I wouldn't say almost to full force, but close to full force, just minus our 3 Ignis, minus... 3 True King Return and minus 3 Dynamite. We're basically still at full power, and with the use of a mono, we don't have to worry about hand traps. But you still have to worry about the Mirror Match, Apocalypse, Pop the Disciples, Pop Heritage, Half Your Attack, etc., etc. You know, Judgment can still stop Diagram. It There are a few things that can still st stop Diagram. You know, Mistake stops Diagram evenly matched. I mean, the, the list can go on, but... What? That's the scary part of the ban list for me. I, I think Masterpiece or Diagram will be getting hit this ban list. One of the two, if not both, it would really suck if they hit both because that would kill Dracos completely. Now another, few, now another few things in the Draco deck I do see getting hit is Heritage. Heritage is a staple, you know, against the mirror match as well. It's... 
the god card included in the mirror match whenever you pop your opponent's monsters as well your monsters spells traps monsters if they're true draco or true kings hey you can draws off that because technically they went from the field to the graveyard and it doesn't specify your side of the field but it's once per turn you can also you, you can also use it to uh tribute someone again put another ignis put another masterpiece drive majesty onto the field to set up more board presence and then after you have three or more in your graveyard use disciples shuffle three back shuffle your true kings or turn back shuffle two heritages you know and then you draw a card that card considering half this more than half this deck of spells you're probably going to draw a, a duality a demise hopefully one of the draw cards you know but there's also a possibility you get one of the others so draco's on a very scary spot right now uh but if they do hit terraforming back, back, back to the terraforming if they do hit terraforming there is a card that will be used at least on my side of the field metaverse came in circuit break i believe it's a rare in circuit break so it's i think it's a short print rare but it's very good target one field spell from your deck and either activate it or add it to your hand which means if your opponent pops your diagram during their turn chain metaverse your diagram's gone you put another diagram onto your side of the field or into your hand it's they might preemptively hit it too don't get me wrong konami's done it but i don't think they will it's a long shot that they'll hit Metaverse. It has seen zero play since it's come out. But if Terraforming gets hit, expect to see a rare be 4 to $5. I'm calling it right now. Terraforming gets hit, Metaverse is going to be the new one. It's a trap, so it's a little bit slower, yes. But it's fantastic. Uh, let's see, what else can get hit? We are probably going to expect Strike to get hit to two. I don't know why, guys. Don't get me wrong. I've just seen some forms around. Strike might get hit to two. It's one of the more used Solemns. Hey. Um, another form of a card that might get hit is... Let me go down. Pendulum Magicians are going to get slaughtered this I'm calling it right now. They're gonna get sl they're they're gonna absolutely slaughtered. You know, Astrograph is gonna get hit. I'm calling it right now. He is too good to be that prevalent. Too good, way too good. And then we got our OTK starving venoms. Stupid how well that works, but I don't run the OTK version, guys. Don't get me wrong. I'm not a degenerate. Uh, you know, harmonizing might get hit. Purple Poison might get hit. Dark War might get hit to one. Granted, we don't really use more than one. Um, <clears throat> but Astrograph and Oaf Dragon probably going to get hit. You know, it, they're too good of a card. It's ridiculous how stupid they are. <sighs> but yeah. They're going to get hit. Astrograph is... Dunzo, I'm calling it right now. I don't want more Pendulum Magicians being a number one deck. If they hit Draco, be it light, we're already crying in the corner after the last ban list. We're still licking our wounds. You know, we're, we're, we're getting back up there. We're still licking our wounds. Alright, what other decks do I have that might get hit? Oh yeah, Trick Stars. Let me go down to Trick Stars. Here's the deck profile I wanted to show you. So here it is right now. It's a special place in hell for me for this for making this deck. I was bored. Don't get me wrong, guys. I didn't make it just so I can play it. I don't play Church Stars in real life. I trade all the ones I get. But Church Star, this is a new Church Star that, that'll be coming out. Actually pretty broken. Don't get me wrong. It's actually pretty broken. Uh, but Reincarnation. Church Star Reincarnation is going to get hit calling it right now uh, to one at least I want to say to one because in the OCG I believe it's already at one and that would be fantastic if trick stars can get nerfed a bit because I don't want their uh, triple reincarnation droll 
Draw combo, which annoys all of me inside. <sighs> Sorry about that, guys. I only woke up a few hours ago. I wanted to make this video before work. But yeah, Trick Stars are getting new links as well in, in the upcoming sets. Bella M Madonna. Uh, don't even know how to pronounce that. Uh, let's see, Foxy Witch, ha uh, we, we, we already have Hall Angel, we don't have Bloody Mary, I don't think, we don't, we have Black Cat, we don't have Bloom, Bloom, these are all pretty great Link monsters, we don't really use more, more, more than, uh, Hall Angel, but, you know, this deck is pretty broken, it's disgusting how well this works, because no matter what card you really play, your, your opponent's gonna get burned, unless it's the Desires, Terraforming, or Duality. No matter what card it is, your opponent's getting your shit on. <laughs> uh, I, I don't know if I'm going to do a deck, prof uh, deck video on that, though. That's kind of disgusting. Dark Magicians. Here we go. I see these getting hit as well. It showed promise. And I'm only going to call D DMC. DMC is probably going to get hit. That's the last card I'm going to say, in my opinion. The DMC gonna get hit it's uh it's up there you know you don't need to use blue boy in the, uh, no I do use blue boy but you don't need to use blue boy it's just an extender to thin out your deck eternal soul navigations you know this deck is actually pretty good but Draco Sack god I fucking Draco Sack Akashic is where it's at guys for the magicians but yeah guys that's my prediction for the TCG ban list. I'll see if I can leave a list up here in case you guys didn't follow me or my mic is still absolute garbage and, and I haven't gotten a new one, which I know I haven't, so it's still garbage. But yeah, guys, if you uh, want to support me, I'll leave the Patreon link in the description. I'll leave the PayPal link in the description. I'll leave my TCG uh, seller's account, you know, so you can buy cards off me. I'll leave my Facebook link, guys. And yeah, that's that's it, guys. Hopefully, uh, hopefully my fears with your videos don't come true. And take it easy. Stay cool. See ya.